and Master. Of all the beautiful truths pertaining to the soul which have been restored and brought to light in this age, none is more gladdening or more fruitful of divine promise and confidence than this, that man is the master of thought, the molder of character, and the maker and shaper of condition, environment, and destiny. As a being of power, intelligence, and love, and the Lord of his own thoughts, man holds the key to every situation, and contains within himself that transforming and regenerative agency by which he may make himself what he wills. Man is always the master, even in his weaker and most abandoned state, but in his weakness and degradation he is the foolish master who misgoverns his household. When he begins to reflect upon his condition and to search diligently for the law upon which his being is established, he then becomes the wise master, directing his energies with intelligence and fashioning his thoughts to fruitful issues. Such is the conscious master. And man can only thus become by discovering within himself the laws of thought, which discovery is totally a matter of application, self-analysis, and experience. Only by much searching and mining are gold and diamonds obtained, and man can find every truth connected with his being, if he will dig deep into the mine of his soul, and that he is the maker of his character, the molder of his life, and the builder of his destiny. He may unerringly prove, if he will watch, control, and alter his thoughts, tracing their effects upon himself, upon others, and upon his life and circumstances, linking cause and effect by patient practice and investigation, and utilizing his every experience, even to the most trivial everyday occurrence, as a means of obtaining that knowledge of himself which is understanding, wisdom, power. In this direction, as in no other, is the law absolute that he that seeketh findeth, and to him that knocketh it shall be opened. For only by patience, practice, and ceaseless importunity can a man enter the door of the temple of knowledge.